Welcome, my name is Sharon Pearce and I'll be doing an experiment for Year 3 for Physics. The content descriptor I'll be using is heat can be produced in many ways and can move from one object to another. The elaborations on this are identifying changes that occur in everyday situations due to heating and cooling and exploring how heat can be transferred through conduction. How will the students achieve this? Students will use a mirror and sunlight to transfer solar heat to cook popcorn. The materials needed will be popcorn kernels, small stainless steel pot, mirror and sunlight. The mirror will reflect the sunlight and generate heat. The heat reflected from the sunlight will bounce off the mirror and hit the popcorn kernels. Science involves making predictions and describing patterns and relationships. Students will have a class discussion on different ways we use heat, where it comes from and what would happen if we didn't have it. With guidance, identify questions in familiar contexts that can be investigated scientifically and make predictions based on prior knowledge. A class discussion on predictions about what will happen will include the following focus questions. Do you think the popcorn will pop? How does the heat travel to the popcorn? What environmental changes could change our results? Students will record all of their predictions. With guidance, plan and conduct scientific investigations to find answers to questions considering the safe use of appropriate materials and equipment. Teacher will demonstrate to students how to hold mirror to reflect the sunlight and concentrate it onto the popcorn. Compare results with predictions, suggesting possible reasons for findings. The students will record a recount of what happened to the popcorn. Reflect on investigations, including whether a test was fair or not. Students will have class discussion on whether the test was fair or not. Was there enough sunshine? How would this relate to other real life situations? Who would be affected by this if, they, if it wasn't possible? The cognitive ability of the students. Students in Year 3 are able to understand that reflection is the opposite of absorption. They will see that instead of the heat being absorbed, it will bounce off the mirror. Students will be able to understand that objects like a hot road have absorbed the heat and will burn their feet, whereas the mirror has not absorbed any of it and has sent it on to the object it is pointing at. Generally, things that are darker in colour absorb more heat than lighter things. Some of the students' alternative misconceptions may include the popcorn won't cook, the sun doesn't heat my hand up that much, so how can a mirror make all the difference? Students will learn that the, the mirror reflects the sunlight into a concentrated point, creating more heat. This is our initial setup with our pan and our popcorn and our mirror reflecting the, the sun. We see here that the popcorn is light in colour and it is starting to slowly, slowly heat. This process is much different to cooking popcorn in a pot 
as the heat is very intense over a flame. The heat from the sun is a lot slower. As the students are looking at, at the, the popcorn slowly heating, the focus questions come into play. They will be wondering, is the popcorn going to pop? They'll be looking around at their environment and discussing whether it, it's hot enough, whether the rays from the sun are bright enough, whether the cool air or the wind is affecting it. Students would also be wondering, would it cook faster in the summer compared to the winter? We can see here, it's a little difficult to see that the, the pan is actually heating up. So I've put some butter here just to show you how hot the pan is underneath the and how hot the corn kernels are getting. You can see the color of the corn kernels are now darkening because of the heat. Students would also be noticing that the sun is moving, so the actual reflection is moving also on the pan. And unfortunately, after 22 minutes and 50 seconds, the popcorn kernels had not popped. So that was the conclusion of this experiment that it didn't pop, but the heat definitely had transferred from the mirror and the reflection onto the popcorn kernels and the pan. Thank you. It is important that children understand the dangers of fire that can be caused by reflecting the sunlight with a mirror and that they do not attempt to do so without adult supervision.